Hello guys and welcome back to another ground hopping video. Today we're going off to the Havill Stadium to watch Sheppey United against Tunbridge Wells in the Kent Senior Trophy first round. So what are your thoughts on today's game? Uh, as uh, you know I enjoy games of uh, this standard. Um, two teams from Scaffold, always very competitive and these are two of the other better teams at Scaffold as well. So I'm expecting a really good game tonight, looking forward to it. Um, and um, yeah, I, th I think one of the things is it's uh, going to be quite a few goals as well. But Friday night football, I, I like Friday night football, a nice way to start the weekend. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to today's game. Uh, both teams are very, uh, well, they're, they're traditionally quite favourites to go up uh, for the last couple of seasons. Um, Sheppey, they're probably one of the title contenders, to be honest. Uh, Tunbridge Wells haven't really done that well so far this season, really. But, um, yeah, they're both in the Southern Counties EC Premier Division, the ninth tier. So, what is your prediction? Yeah, it will be a lot of goals. Um, uh, let's say 3-2 to Sheppey. Yeah, I think it would be 4-2 to Sheppey. Um, they always score loads of goals when I see them play. Uh, I'll see you inside the Havill Stadium. Now into home park, the home of Sheppey United. So, what are your thoughts on this ground then? It's nice, isn't it? I'm, yeah. yeah I'm, I'm, I'm Apologise to Sheppey, I wasn't expecting something as good as this, but I'm very impressed with the setup. There's um, yeah, two bits of terracing, one, one stand, a uh, very smart 3G pitch, a scoreboard, and a gantry on the other side. Mm. Yeah, they're very fitting of, of, of a level or two higher than this. Mm. Yeah, they've done well. Yeah, it's a very um, nice ground for the ninth tier. Um, they look like it's been like refurbished over the summer because I remember they weren't playing the home games during the lockdown cup because they were playing at Chatham but um, yeah it looks very good for the night tiers it's better than some of the grounds in the National League South to be honest um, so so yeah let's hopefully it's a good game Oh! 
Half time, Sheppy nil, Tubbage Wells nil. Half time here at Holm Park, it's currently Sheppey United nil, Tunbridge Wells nil. So, what are your thoughts on the first half? Yeah, it's hard to think how it can be nil nil, really. Sheppey seem to have um, got forward quite a bit, and the finishing is, uh, for them has been disappointing. But I'm really impressed with the atmosphere, the crowd, um, and I don't know if we pointed out yet, the game actually had to have a delayed kickoff due to crowd congestion. I can't think the last time that happened in the first round of the Kent Senior Trophy before, maybe never. But um, yeah, but it's, it's the Friday night thing has really brought everyone out. Yeah, I think, um, well, it's not been a good game at all, really. Both teams' finishing is really, really poor, and it's like every time there's a one and one or anything, everything's skied over the bar and just going wide. Um, yeah, no one seems to know their goal is. Sheffield, I believe, have a weakened team, so that's why they're not getting the goals. But yeah, brilliant atmosphere and brilliant crowd here, but then again, it's Friday night, and that just shows that like, when there's Friday night football, there's more people, more attendances, and clubs get more, more money from it, so more clubs should follow suit in my opinion. But yeah, uh, not that good game to follow, let's hope for a goal in the second half.
Sheffield is Sheffield United 4, Tunbridge Wells nil. What are your thoughts on the game? Yeah, on the game itself, um, what's strange in the first half, um, Sheppey seemed to be um, the better side um, and went in nil-nil. And in the second half, I wasn't sure there was much in it and Sheppey 4-0 up. Um, so, um, yeah, just uh, making the most of, uh, of the chances they had. Um, second goal, I wasn't sure it was a penalty, but anyway, it uh, um, didn't really matter in the scheme of things. But the other thing I found really odd was this whole down the of the game. Was, First half's all right. Second half, I thought there seemed to be loads of people there who, who weren't been paying attention to the match. There was uh, people to my left sort of having some sort of disagreement about something. People over to my right was children who didn't seem to want to be there, was running around the stands quite a lot. Loads of people walking about. Um, but anyway, um, um, enjoyed the game and um, yeah, and Sheppey well worth the win. Yeah, I thought it was uh, an all right game really. Um, first half wasn't really good at all. Second half, it did improve. Um, I felt that um, Tunbridge Wells, when they uh, went one 0 down, they really like pushed on. But um, then when Sheppey got their second, their heads just dropped, and the floodgates opened for for Sheppey to get the second, third, and fourth. Um, yeah, it was a good atmosphere. Although, like I said, it did feel the uh, you know lots of people talking and walking about and things like that, which is quite annoying when you go to games. Um, but then again. It was a Friday, so maybe a lot of people who went are properly Sheppy fans, you know. But yeah, it was nice to see so many people there as well for the ninth tier as well. Um, see you then, good luck, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.